You are cursed above all cattle and above all wild animals. Upon your belly you shall go, and thus you shall eat all the days of your life. I will put enmity between you and the woman, between your seed and her seed. He shall bruise your head, and you shall bruise his heel. Then the Lord God said, Behold, the man has become like one of us, knowing good and evil, and now lest he put forth his hand and also take the tree of life, and eat and live forever. Therefore the Lord God sent him forth from the garden of Eden to till the ground from which he was taken. He drove out the man. And at east of the garden of Eden, he placed a cherubim and a flaming sword, which turned every way to guard the way to the tree of life. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. our Lord. Thanks be to God. O God, make speed to save us.
and blessed be his kingdom, now and forever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Let us pray. Purify our conscience, almighty God, by your daily visitation, that your Son, Jesus Christ, at his coming, may find in us a mansion prepared for himself, who lives and reigns with you, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, now and forever. Amen.
before him to test. And he said, Hear then, O house of David, is it too little for you to weary the people that you weary my God also? Therefore the Lord himself will give you a son. Behold, a young woman shall conceive and bear a son, and shall call his name the man of God with us. The word of the Lord. Praise God. According to Luke. In the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent from God to a city of Gal Galilee named Nazareth to a virgin betrothed to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David, and the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel came to her and said, Hail, O favored one, the Lord is with you. But she was greatly troubled at the saying and considered in her mind what sort of greeting this might be. And the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And behold, you will conceive in your room and bear a son. And you shall call his name Jesus, and he will be great and will be called the Son of Most High. And the Lord God will give to him the throne of his father David. And he will reign over the house of Jacob forever. And of his kingdom there will be no end. And Mary said to the angel, how can this be, since I have no husband? And the angel said to her, The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. Therefore the child to be born will be called Holy, the Son of God. And behold, your kinswoman Elizabeth, in her old age, has also conceived a son. And, his, and this is the sixth month with her, who was, called, who was called barren. For with God nothing will be impossible. And Mary said, Behold, I am the handmaid of the Lord. Let it be to me according to your word. And the angel departed from her. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God.
The Word of God, written in the Gospel according to Luke. In those days, a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be enrolled. This was the first enrollment. When Cornelius, his wife, governor of Syria, and all went to be enrolled, each to their own city. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, from the city of Nazareth, to Judea, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, to be enrolled with Mary, his betrothed, who was with child. And while they were there, for the time came for her to be delivered, she gave birth to her firstborn son, and wrapped him in swaddling cloths, and laid him in a manger because there was no place for them in the inn. And in that region there were shepherds out in the fields, keeping watch over their flock by night. And an angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the God of the Lord shone around them, and they were filled with fear. And the angel said to them, Be not afraid, for behold, I bring you good news of great joy, which will come to all people. For you, for to you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. Heard it. And this will be a sign for you. You will find a babe wrapped in swaddling cloths and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace among those whom he is pleased. When the angels went away from them into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go over to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has made known to us. And they went with haste, found Mary and Joseph in the big lying in manger, the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. <laughs>
that they may enter the city by the gates. I am the root of the offspring of David, the bright morning star. The spirit and the bride say, come. And let those who hear say, come. And let those who are thirsty come. Let them that desire to take the water of life without price. He who testifies to these things says, Surely I am coming soon. Amen. 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 Amen.